When I think of a gin and tonic, I think of old, rich white people. Hmm, 50 years old. But actually, it has quite an interesting story behind it. The story begins in 17th century Peru, where the Spanish discovered that the indigenous peoples there were using the bark of the cachona tree to treat various fevers. And one of these fevers was malaria. Now, in British colonial India in the 19th century, the officials and soldiers stationed there were suffering from malaria. And thanks to the Spanish, they now had the means to treat it. But since they didn't want to chew on the bark, they ground it up into a powder. They referred to it as quinine powder. But since this powder was bitter, they decided to mix it in with homemade tonic water, which was just soda and sugar. Before the 19th century, gin was considered lower class. But here in colonial India, it was now considered respectable. So respectable, in fact, that they took to mixing it in their tonic water quinine powder mixture in the afternoon. And thus, the gin and tonic was born. That story always tears me up a bit. Just kidding, I feel nothing. Now that the history lesson's over, let me go show you how to make one. I chose the Cucumber Rosemary Variation, which you can find on the website right below my head here. Thanks for watching. And if you want to see more videos like this with a drink history in a tutorial, just let me know and I'll make some more. Alright, thanks guys. Okay.